It strikes me, Hubert, that you have confidence in yourself as a leader. Have you run into others that just don't have the confidence in themselves as a leader? They need to have these kind of annual reviews and so on? You say I'm confident. Like many, I am an insecure overachiever, and I'm trying to <laughs> get cured. And like many, I suffer from the imposter syndrome. Uh, so if you suffer, if you're listening, and if you're suffering from the imposter syndrome, welcome to the club. <laughs> and, and the reason why we suffer from the imposter syndrome is that continuously we're stretching ourselves as leaders, and so we end up doing things that we've not necessarily done before. And so the turnaround of Best Buy and I've never turn around a major retailer. And certainly today, so maybe we can slow down on this, Gary. In the world we live in, this idea of not saying I don't know, that's crazy. Did you have the manual for how to deal with COVID, Gary? Probably not. Yeah. Do you have the manual for how to deal with back to the office? No, there's no such thing. And so I think as leaders, we need to be confident to be able to say, gee, that's unprecedented. I don't have the answer, but let's figure it out together. So it's a combination of confidence, but also humility and vulnerability. And my most frequently used phrase these days is my name is Hubert and I need help. <laughs>